I knew exactly what I wanted. I just didn't know how to get there. Mentorship is gaining the confidence of the person whom you are going to mentor. HB has really opened up avenues for me to flourish as a scholar. The HB year was the turning point of my research as a scholar. I seek ways for engagement with other humanists. Break boundaries and forge ahead in humanity scholarship. The African Humanities Program, um, I would say, is key and central to the development of the College of Humanities itself here at the University of Dar es Salaam. Uh, one of the first uh, success stories that we have about the African Humanities Program is the support that it has given to our members of staff. So I was able to start thinking and writing, you know, formulating, drafting my ideas into a publication. So I, it was like some sort of starting an academic journey immediately from my PhD. But also, um, the AHP has uh, fueled members of staff to broaden and expand their fields of scholarship. Uh, seek ways for engagement with other humanists in the field. I was able to draft papers, like two papers, and I was able to push one of those two through to a submission process during the residence. And then later on I came also to uh, finish up the second one, and they are all now they are all now published papers emanated from AHP uh, fellowship. So these papers have been used for my, my promotion. But also the other contribution, which is also due to residents, I have been able to create networks with South Africa, particularly speaking with UWC and then UCT at the uh, University of Cape Town in a center for African Studies Center. And out of these networks, we share and we have different forums and we talk and discuss issues related with humanities. One of the major challenge, I think, is that um, the culture that goes with competing, competing for something, uh, you try once and you're not successful. Uh, tendencies to try again, usually a lot of people pull themselves back and don't think that, you know, they had, they did a very good job in the first tryout. It was not easy to receive uh, AHP scholarship. I tried for the first time 2015 without any success. Later on I tried another chance 2016. I succeeded to score dissertation fellowship. I would say challenges could be there, but there are ways to solve these challenges and address them accordingly. After that, I succeeded to get another fellowship, which is known as Residential Fellowship for AHP, where I succeeded to go to Kampala, Makelele University, and I spent almost three months, as it was before. In that three months, I succeeded to come out with a paper and then I succeeded to produce one of my papers that is for the first time appearing in lighting. As a program, I think it's a very well structured program, which requires very minimal intervention from the, um, the managers of the program. AHP has, been, has played a crucial role in raising our profile. Out of the 38 applicants, uh, or uh, successful candidates of the AHP postdoctoral and the fellowships, I would say over 70% of them have been promoted. It's a huge plus for us. I, I liked the way people working in the humanities, the way uh, the um, eager, you know, the um, ready, ready to kind of push humanities, you know, 
uh, programs or program ahead. PhD supervision, the capacity has increased. Even for uh, master's level dissertations, capacity has increased. We have come from departments that were ailing, such as the Department of Literature, uh, which had only four members of staff. Now it has a full-fledged 21 members of staff. I have insisted in others to apply, and that is some, they thought that AHP is selecting people from maybe the big universities, and that it is only for the, those who have scored the PhD rather than giving the chance for those who are completing their own work or for those who have, that may be the, for those who are having masters, also they want to score such a fellowship. The African Humanities Program, I would say, has given purpose to many institutions within Africa, has increased the profile of the humanities in Africa. AHP is a breath of fresh air. Thank you.